Alright guys, so what's going on in the hoodie head? Turn my music just a little bit there. What's going on in the hoodie and back today? Again, I don't know when to upload this video. I'm uploading all these videos on waves. Um, so yeah, Fortnite anniversary is slowly just going away on Global, so I mean a few more days is going to go away, but I just want to go over every little thing that we have for the Fortnite anniversary. I was going to do a video on it earlier, then I was like, nah, I'll just, you know, go ahead and do it, because, hey, family friendly. Um, then I got my dog right here. Whoa, it might be kind of bright, because face cam clear. I am going to try to fix it in the future as well. I know it's bad, but yeah. So the first thing we did, we had the tournament. We had the Kid Goku. Kid Goku. We had the Awakening for this. Goku we had like for years and years and years. There's, yeah, there's Ubisoft here too. They should have had him Doku Awakening. Um, I don't know why. Um, it was super, you know, super mills and stuff like that. Then we had um, Kid Pin right here. She wasn't the best World Tournament card, but... Yeah, hey, something. Um, and now here we have a few more stuff. We had um, the Guru event. We could perform up to 100%. We had the B Pan event. You could do the B Pan to LR. Well, it took about a week. Um, didn't take that long. Then we had the Hercule ticket on um, the Hercule event where you could basically get tickets and stuff like that. We should have got the GT Hercule. It would be kind of like, you know, as a cool, like, tournament prize overall. It was really cool, though. Um, then we had the new login bonus. And we have rewards you can get this Goku through via missions. Um, I think it goes to like nine. I'm um, seeing so format SA. I want to do paths. Simple stuff like that. I think I have one more. Oh, oh. Excuse me. No, excuse me. I think he was like, um, you could also get him with, I'm trying to think what else. Login bonus, you can get four copies, and you get the rest of them here, so you can max out his essay. Or you can move to the LR Goku, if it felt like it, for only 100% chance, because if you dug him, you are 100% chance. 100% chance. Um, then we had the um, new trunks right here, actually, too. It was really, like, he was okay. But if he ever gets a Duck Awakening on the next year, because they tend to do that for you, um, girl, you know, for all we know, he, he could get it easy in next year. I mean, hey, they did for, um, whatchamacallit. I'm only 300 million downloads at this point, because it's confirmed. If you haven't already, go check out my other bit out. Um, what else is down here? Um, yeah, uh, for all we know, yeah, he could get easy, like, Goku Jr., that's what I'm gonna say. They had his easy, we had, like, Hega Stones and stuff like that. That was great. They did heard Super Saiyan 4 is the big cojones of himself. Actually, you guys don't, if you guys didn't check out my Instagram post, I pulled both of them, by the way. So that's really great. I'm really happy about that. I think I have every unit. I did pull this trunk, so he's really good. Like, the trunk of Goku, they're really great. They're just, they're, they're outshined just by the Super Saiyan 4s, I feel like it. Um, but yeah, overall, they're really good as well. Like, other people would like to down on them. They are, like, some of the best units, like, right here. I mean, there's a lot of best units in the game. You know, for truth, it's LR Kelly Cleef. For. for me, anyway, I feel like, um, my favorite LR probably is Tech LR Broly, because, like, his animations are just, like, I feel like they're, they're the best in the game. In my opinion, anyway, I feel like he's probably the best LR. LR. But, you know, it's, it's in my opinion. Um, yeah, like, this Goku's really good. Also, like, Lynx, um, Passive Pretty Solid, um, Leader Skill, typical stuff like that. Trunks is good as well. Like, he went from being, like, the worst SSR in the game to being, like, one of the like legit best like units because again he's good though i'm um, already gonna like go for like all the hero stuff like that for global anyway so yeah um we should probably get the info attendance recording i don't know when like i, I again i don't know when it'll probably get tomorrow or whenever it comes out because i don't know when i'm gonna upload this completely forgot about that then um you know we had awakenings then um you know for all the two super, super saiyan 4 units we already know they're op like some of the best cards in the game then we have these four units down here which i did actually rainbow i can rainbow these uh guys but i can't rainbow but yeah because i didn't get any dupes i'm surprised i didn't pull them at all i pulled kyle can go go find out the final dupe because again they're on the banner typical stuff like that um we do just don't know um, and then we got Super Saiyan 3, um, 2 Goku, again, you can run, like, you can run all these on the same team if you felt like it, you know, I think these two mainly were just focused on attack, these two, video mainly focused on building up his defense and stuff and his attack, you guys are looking at Goku, man, <sighs> oh no, whatever that comes to global, um, then they had, like, you know, Super Saiyan 2, Andrew Goku, Masha Vegeta, again, like, all these units are great, they're all great, and these are changed orbs, they're amazing, these two are um, just a great for attacking stuff. The Goku's set, yeah, like they're both attacking, they're attacking defense. Both good for the legendary Goku event, besides them because for the last stage, you're not going to really get them, but it uh, happens. Um, then down here we have a, we had a little bit few more stuff. He has some more punching machine events, which I did beat the Dragonstone one. I beat all of them. I like get about two, three days, about a day or two, so it's really great though. The other missions are really easy, so if you haven't already, again, I made videos on everything, so. Yeah, um, we had the Shadow Dragon event where you can fight all the Shadow Dragons. Um, then we had this um, Shadow Dragon event where you fought them. Um, and then this one, I think you fought them with stipulations. This one, you. No, no, that's the other one. Um, this is all one where you know, ending a GT and stuff like that. Then we have Vegeta Jr.'s EZA. Um, pretty good. I did keep actually, if you guys didn't notice, um, I don't think I posted it at the time of this recording. I don't know when. 
Um, but I did actually remember this, his SSR version. I know he doesn't use EA, but nah, I did because I felt like it. Because they two again have two different names, so you can't just run them on the same team. Like, and you can easily A him, so you can't easily A him, but I. <laughs> Excuse me. Happens. Um, what else done here? Uh, they have the GT um battlefield basically. I think it's up until what I think next week at the time it's recording. I don't know when, but then we had um our Oob. He was great. Um, he's I mean he's better when he transformed, of course. But yeah, then we had the um LR, Then we had the super top summon Sama. The LR baby. I actually with him. Man, I used to miss him with battle road like for the his ape transformation. It was so freaking good. Like. Just like that ape transformation, great. And these guys are like again for baby. You can't keep an SSR version of him because it's just Super Baby, no Baby Vegeta. This Super Baby Two One, he will Doken Wake into that. Super Baby Two, that's when actually Doken Wake. Okay. He had like a great ape transformation, just like by himself. And that would have been like you can for like, like four babies. So yeah, you can't run all their versions like LR Cone Cleefo. You can do that. LR Broly, STR Broly, you can do that. LR Goku Black, you can do that. Tech one. Um yeah, then we had the um, LR Trio again. They are really great for the Dragon Ball Seekers. And plus, that team is basically basically like I feel like it's like one of the best. Like they're just legitimately one of the best free play teams in the game. Point blank and period. Because have those units in the youth category. Because youth in Dragon Ball Seekers, um, and the Game Four. I just feel like those three are like some of the best. Like. Units they have like for the free to play team, you know, free to play like these free to play cards are just half of them are good. You can get half of them from the red stone anyway. I, I count them as free to play because again, you don't use so many summoning stones to get them. You can use them getting a red stone, two different stones, people. Um, but yeah, again, like these guys are just amazing. By the way, I'm um, then down here. I'm um, like all these cards, like they're just both monsters, especially our baby. L baby is a freaking just nuke destroyer. Then down here is the last bit we had. We had the Mega Shamrock EZA. After you um basically get the Shadow Dragon. I think after you beat like this event. Let me go back up here. If you guys didn't know, you had to beat this event first. Yeah, but yeah, then they had to collect all the crack star Dragon Balls. So then Black Smoke Shimron or Black Shimron as I call him, because he's a homie Black Shimron. He smokes. He's like, woo! I know I smoked on my arm, but hey, happens. And then down here, I think we had um, GT Goku's EZA. Again, he's really amazing as well. We just had like a whole bunch of like free to play units. That's what one, two, I count that, two, three, what, um, four, five, six, seven, like eight, nine, just like. I mean, not for, I mean, it might, it might not have seen that much, but yeah, I feel like this had like a lot of content. Basically, for part two, when part two hit, I feel like that was like the best. Like, it's just insane like for just everything they're all the all stones we got i think as the other bonus in swift like i feel like we're gonna get you know because i think last year before the anniversary ended or it might have been the gogeta and broly anime um one where they actually had like you know um where they actually had like you know thank you for, like for all the stuff that we did like it was like near the end of the year for global anyway and jp i remember that um they actually had an event where he said oh hey thank you for so much um he was like number one in the app store I feel like we're not gonna hit it hit it anymore but on the last day we could potentially hit it I don't know but yeah this is like almost a milestone it's almost a thousand stones so if you saved up maybe one summon the very very last day or save for the hero stuff these these are all like good stones like from missions like again the fourth anniversary for me anyway it's just it been it was better than last year's anniversary in my opinion it's just like it's so good like all these units everybody's so so destructive actually made to move that back a little bit. Yeah, just like all this stuff this is so good, like so much content, so much everything. I, again, I do think the Fort Universal was really explosive. Explosive, great baby is whatever. So yeah, see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Peace out. Have a great day. Great life. Great everything! So yeah, see you guys later. Peace out. Again, have a great day. Everything. Everything.